Love did not end on that lonely hill. Love did not end in the coldness of the tomb. Love broke the chains of death and walked free, never to die again. did go away, but he promised he would come again. And as in the centuries before Bethlehem, the world is again made ready. Jesus said, for nation will rise against nation, and there will be famines and earthquakes, but all these things are just the beginning. Millions perish as famines spread from Africa to India. More die in earthquakes today than ever before in human history. Terrorism and the threat of nuclear war holds the world in bondage. Jesus said, for the coming of the Son of Man will be just like it was in the days of Noah. Pornography being sold in the corner drugstores. One in three homes, a victim of crime. Humanism working for a world free from the myth of God. But Jesus also said, and this gospel of the kingdom will be proclaimed in the whole world for a witness to all the nations, and then the end shall come. Satellite technology beams the Christian message to every corner of the globe. Bibles by the millions in every language and dialect pour from printing presses. After centuries of division, Bible-believing Christians everywhere are uniting around the simple gospel in an effort to reach every man with a saving message of Christ. And so, after 2,000 years, the world is once more ready. Israel has been reborn. The Temple Mound has been reclaimed. The world has been prepared. And once again, as in the days of wise men and shepherds, the people of God with anxious hearts are waiting for someone to come. The of this world has become the kingdom of our Lord and of his Christ. And on his robe he has a name written. He is the King of kings. He is the Lord of lords. And he shall reign forever.